troubleshooting the RapidRH Bluetooth Smart Reader. We've been getting more and more phone calls regarding the new RapidRH Bluetooth Smart Reader and device connectivity issues. The call usually goes something like this. I just got my Smart Reader and it doesn't work. Of course, we never like to hear this about any of our products. On the surface, I would usually start troubleshooting technically reasons why, but after doing a couple times unsuccessfully, I realized I wasn't understanding the real issue. The real issue is that the smart reader doesn't interact with the chosen device like most other Bluetooth devices do. People are used to having to manually pair the two devices to each other, and with the latest Bluetooth technology that we are using, this step is unnecessary. So with other types of Bluetooth devices, you would expect to see the smart reader in the Bluetooth settings on your device. And with our smart technology, there's nothing. Yet, when I open up the Data Master app, take the smart reader and just insert it into the sensor, it transmits the necessary information. Now, realistic expectations at this juncture are also very important. Sometimes the initial communication between the two devices can be slower than we would want. If you insert the smart reader into the sensor and keep it in contact between the two the entire time and don't have data transfer within 15 seconds, then pull the reader out of the sensor, turn the entire body of the reader 10 to 15 degrees and insert it back into the sensor and go through the process as before. Usually, once the initial reading is complete, subsequent readings are seamless. If you have any additional questions regarding the smart reader or the data master, please don't hesitate to contact us directly. Let us know if you've ever used any other products that utilize Bluetooth smart technology.